Less than a year ago, Johnny Depp's court battle against Amber Heard overwhelmed fans and headlines across the world. Now, as Gwyneth Paltrow, 50, is in the midst of her own high-profile trial, Johnny's lawyer Benjamin Chu has warned the actress about her behavior in court, saying she's acting like a prima donna. The lead attorney in Johnny's victorious defamation case, Benjamin offered some insights and advice for Gwyneth on court TV. The actress has been openly unhappy about being filmed and photographed inside and around the courthouse, using a blue notebook to hide her face every now and again. However, Benjamin declared she needs to lose the notebook, adding, This isn't a family vacation away from the crowds when you have a legitimate expectation of privacy. This is a courthouse. Benjamin berated Gwyneth's behavior and that of her lawyer, saying it doesn't help her to play the part of a prima donna and look like a sad sack on the stand. He also issued her a warning, pointing out that in Court TV's video coverage of the case on Thursday he noticed she didn't stand up when the judge and jury entered the courtroom. The legal expert understood that it may have just been nervousness or an accident but noted, that comes off as very disrespectful. General demeanor is very important. You have to assume that at any given moment one of the jurors is looking at you as the client. All eyes are going to be on them at every moment so they have to be at their best. Not slouching, not grimacing, not reacting to negative testimony. They have to use their acting abilities to retain their composure. Benjamin insinuated that Gwyneth's legal counsel may also have been to blame for this faux pas. Prior to the trial, attorneys and clients have multiple meetings during which Benjamin noted it's vital to choreograph everything in advance and seemed concerned that her attorneys may be more focused on cameras and photographs. Don't miss, John Bishop in pain like no other as he says beloved mum has died, latest, Jeremy Paxman puts on brave face as he's pictured using pain at awards, latest, Emmerdale double pregnancy as fans work out Mackenzie betrayal, latest, as the actress had not yet given her own testimony in the case at the time of Benjamin's interview, the lawyer offered some pristine words of advice for the nerve-wracking moment. If there are weaknesses in her story she should embrace them rather than hide from them. I don't know, in this case, whether there are any blind spots in her story, but I don't think she should run away from them. Benjamin added that if he was representing Gwyneth he would have prepared her by getting someone very difficult to come at her in a mock cross-examination so that she's ready for it. The actress is being sued by Terry Sanderson who claims she crashed into him while they were both skiing down the same hill at Deer Valley Resort in 2016. The retiree claims he suffered several severe injuries including broken ribs while Gwyneth is counter-claiming that Terry was the party at fault and is seeking a symbolic amount of $1. On Friday the actress took to the stand, revealing that she feels very sorry but added, It seems like Hess had a very difficult life but I did not cause the accident so I cannot be at fault for what subsequently happened to him. The actress described herself as an intermediate skier, familiar with the general rules which include right-of-way etiquette, that those further down the hill have right-of-way while those higher up must take action to avoid collisions. Both parties claim they were further down the hill and thus had right-of-way. The trial is ongoing, 